Acne is the most common skin disease treated by physicians. It is a chronic condition that affects over 85% of adolescents, usually starting between the ages of 10 and 13 and lasting for 5 to 10 years. More than half of adolescents with acne require treatment by a physician. Yet it can also affect adults and can continue, especially in women, during times of hormonal change like pregnancy and menopause. Acne is the term for plugged pores, blackheads and whiteheads, pimples and even deeper lumps or cysts that occur on the face, neck, chest, back, shoulders and upper arms. It can be both embarrassing and disfiguring and affects men and women of all races and ethnicities equally. There are different types of acne which respond to different types of treatment. A normal follicle looks like this. Sometimes sebum or oil which normally drains to the surface of the skin becomes blocked in a pore or follicle. Bacteria begin to grow. When the trapped sebum and bacteria stay below the skin's surface, it is called a whitehead. A blackhead is formed when the pore opens to the surface and the sebum, which contains the skin pigment melanin, oxidizes and turns brown or black. It is not dirt and cannot be washed away. A blackhead or whitehead can release its contents to the surface and heal, or the follicle wall may rupture, causing inflammatory acne. Sometimes a rupture can be caused by picking or touching the skin, so it is important to leave acne-prone skin relatively untouched. Picking pimples can cause both discoloration and scarring. Inflammatory acne has different affectations. A papule or pustule occurs when there is a break in the follicular wall. White blood cells rush in, forming what most people refer to as a zit or pimple. Sometimes, an inflamed lesion collapses or explodes, further inflaming the surrounding skin. These lesions are called cysts or nodules. Fortunately, with the right treatment, you can keep acne under control. Many options are available, including prescription creams and antibiotics, which target the various causes of acne. For more difficult cases, blue light therapy, diode laser therapy, or pulsed light and heat therapy may be combined with traditional treatments to help reduce the severity and frequency of acne outbreaks. And if you have any sustained scarring as a result of acne, your physician can advise you on the therapies that can significantly diminish their appearance.